Okay, so I have Hive City Nuke Scene and Warhammer 40k Space Marine 2. Let's go to the video. Detonation in five. Brace for shockwave. Yo, they for real dropped the nuke. That's crazy. We're in Kaduku. I'm pretty sure that's like Earth's uh, like third moon, right? Yeah. I can't lie to you. This does not look good. If I'm on planet Kaduku. And the first thing I see is when I look up and I look at that, I can't lie to you. Oh, well, maybe it is a good thing. Looks like backup. I've never seen like the all black team before. I've seen the I've seen like the blue like you know Marines and stuff like that. These guys look like they look like the Raiders. Oh no! Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that thing is going down. That thing is going down. Hey, hey, that ship is going down. Oh yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. GGs. That ship is absolutely going down. Ooh, spear. Okay. Well, he was about to like. Wait, did he survive? After bro, he was about to like. Wait, wait, that's it, brother. He, bro, did he like land face first? Like, what happened? Like, is that? It? Listen, one thing that I'll say about Warhammer 40k Space Marine 2, bro, this game is absolutely amazing, bro. Just just graphics-wise. Not even, like, talking about the gameplay over there. Let's talk about graphics. Both the gameplay and the cutscenes look absolutely, bro, amazing. It might be, besides Black Myth Wukong, it might be, you know, the best-looking game of 2024. Besides Black Myth Wukong. Black, listen, Black Myth Wukong was just another just level of just, like, Graphics, it was crazy. So definitely Warhammer and, and Black Myth Wukong definitely are fine for number one. But comment down below, man. What do y'all think about this video? So guys, check this out. And please.